No preceding thoughts. Welcome back to Movie Munchies. I'm Alexis. If you've never been here before, we watch things and we eat them. Today we are doing Good Morning Vietnam. In my Aladdin and the King of Thieves video, I posed the question, what is your favorite Robin Williams movie? And I promised to watch whatever the response was. And friend Brave Django said, Good Morning Vietnam. That is the response that I got. But you know what? It was perfect timing because I was looking for something else to watch. So that's what we're doing today. I've never seen it. It's Robin Williams though, and I love him, so I'm excited to watch it. I have my notebook to take notes and see what Good Morning Vietnam gets us in the mood for. Without further ado, initiate entertainment. 1987. I don't know how old he was then. What year was he born? He was born on July 21st in 1951. Math. Somebody do that math for me. Due to a yearly mail rush at that time, don't disappoint you. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> this scared me. This scared me so bad. <laughs> you can't do that. Oh, I don't know if you saw it, but I jumped so hard. Personal missing luggage. That should be personnel missing luggage are asked to drop a card. I used to work for a company that provided systems for the military, basically for flying, so that they could communicate with each other while flying. So this reminds me very much of that. I can't say much about it. I had to sign all kinds of papers or like confidentiality stuff and things I was not allowed to repeat. Though I honestly, I could not tell you what the important things were. I'm Private First Class Edward Montesquieu Garlic at your service, sir. Garlic? First thing, Garlic, is you got to requisition a new name. <laughs> garlic. Oh, she's beautiful and quick. Speed up, check the stamina. <laughs> oh, my God, they're quick, they're fast and small. <laughs> oh, gosh. That's funny. I've never seen him play this kind of character. We got a new man coming in. Don't you understand, Dick? No, sir. Frankly, Dick? I do not understand. Sorry. <laughs> Richard. <laughs> How do you get Dick from Richard? Somebody explain that to me. I deserve to be notified of any changes that are made. Nobody's Dickerson is his name. LOL. <laughs> Sergeant Major Dickerson. <laughs> That's another story altogether. Garlic reminds me of somebody I know, but I don't know who it is. Plus, I think he got shot in the ass, but I can't confirm that. <laughs> anyway, you <laughs> <It's> giggle. <laughs> Garlic, can you put on some weight? Oh, I don't think so, sir. My son, they shot up your ass. Yeah. Oh, that was his face. <laughs> he looks so young. Hang on. I know him. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Forrest Whitaker. <laughs> wow, I didn't recognize him. He's so young. Reader's Digest is considering publishing two of my jokes. Really? Wow. Yeah. Good for you. United States Air Force. The hat does give you away. Is the goal of this movie to get this guy to laugh? <laughs> That is humor. That I is recognize humor. That. I, rec I also recognize your species of soldier. Oh. Species? But not before his humor cost the lives of three very fine individuals. He has no sense of humor. I think the goal is to get this guy to laugh. I'll burn you so bad you'll wish you died as a child. <laughs> Jesus. You will address me as Sergeant Major Dickerson. <laughs> yes, Sergeant Major Dickerson. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Sir, it's time to rise. Are you just hovering over him? Oh, that's a weird way to wake somebody up. He's so short. How tall is he? Dang, why is that? In a televised new conference, President Johnson said the U.S. military commitment will be praised from... Raised from its current level of 75,000 men to 125,000 men almost immediately. I don't know what that means. I read it, but it did not filter anything through. He was 5'7", still taller than me. Good morning, Vietnam! Hey, this is not a test. This is rock and roll. Time to rock it from the Delta to the DMZ. Is that me or does that sound like an Elvis Presley movie? Viva Da Nang. Oh. In his element. Good morning, Vietnam. What the heck is that supposed to mean? It means good morning, Vietnam. 
Let's pull it right back down. Let's try it a little faster. See if that picks it up a little bit. Let's get up on 7.18. Damn, he's so good. He's so good. What a talented man. How much of this was ad lib? Was all of it ad lib? Oh, Lord. <laughs> Nothing's even filtered. I'm just watching him and am entertained. I have no idea what he's saying. I don't find him funny at all. Bitter. Hawk is bitter. Sergeant Dick. Gotta figure out what he tastes like. Is that hot? You know what I'm talking about. What do you think it's gonna be like tonight? It's gonna be hot and wet. That's nice if you're with a lady, but they Has he taken any breaths? <laughs> Thank you, Marty. No, 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 no. We gotta figure out what he is. What's his character's name? I haven't been paying attention. What's his character's name in this movie? Adrian Croner. Mm. So his job is to keep everybody entertained while they are in Vietnam for the war. You know, it's like wearing stripes and plaid. It's for me, I want to do something deep. For some reason, I'm getting banana pudding. Tell me why that is. I'll write it down, but I don't think... <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'm thinking of, like, just bananas in general. Like, slipping on a banana peel. Kind of just like slapstick comedy, you know? That's not really his comedy, but just bananas seems like a silly food for some reason. So I'm thinking of banana pudding. I don't know. I intend to take issue with your performance. Huh, he's so bitter. I'm trying to run a meeting here. You know Why is he so mad? He's jealous. I am a mechanic and I would like salutes occasionally. That's what being a higher rank is all about. He wants to feel important, and he's not. <laughs> what? Huh? I am really my eyes. He's annoying me. What are you giggling about? Seeing as how the VP is such a VIP, shouldn't we keep the PC on the QT? Because if it leaks to the VC, you can end up in an MIA and then I'll be put on KP. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I would like to leave the room now. Oh, uh, yes, sir. No one likes you. There's nothing textually about texture, texturally about banana pudding that I get from him. I think I really think it's just the banana element. Bananas are a silly food. They're used in comedy a lot. I don't know. Banana pudding. It's hot in Vietnam. Banana pudding is a very beautiful dessert to eat in the heat. That's why it's southern. Now you say hi to me, then you smile. Hi. And you look, look at his smile. <laughs> Cheekbones for days, dude. There she is. Uh, any girl who wants me this bad, I can't let her down. Oh my god. Let's go, Edward. Yeah, the chase. <laughs> Not the chase. Oh god. <laughs> She's cute, though. She's cute. But clearly she was uncomfortable when you first approached to, to her. Yeah. Woo! Ooh. <laughs> A truck's bumper was this far from my nose. <laughs> A whole life passed before my eyes. <laughs> and it wasn't even interesting to me. It wasn't even oh, interesting to me. Girl. Is it really like that? Like you see someone and you're just like, them. I have to. I have to have them. Why? Why is it that way? Let me tell you something. You men are bold sometimes. All the time. Quite bold. I have two months to live and I would like to teach before I die. What? Are you serious? What? <laughs> I don't think you understand me, Spark. <clears throat> it's all yours. You good? Oh my god. Are you You're serious? We're serious. Who's this guy who we keep getting a shot of? I'd like to get to know all of you by having you write down your name, address, and your home and work phone on a piece of paper and pass it. Uh, I no. I'll let her say no. She is a no. That is what walking with you means. Okay, I'm interested in a girl. I'm not interested in you playing dare everything. I know he knows what's up. Oh, good brother. You phony. Like American and Frenchy for you. <laughs> you need to get something. Maybe when you're not gay. 
Uh -huh. You come into my class, some of you are like me. You come to the girl, you get her, you go. Okay, Sherlock, yeah. Amen. Little brother knows what's up. Maybe he's older brother, I don't know. Is there any food on this? Street food. <laughs> God! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I like her. Let me get some food of those ankles. Can't give you my ball. <laughs> You're a very sick man, you know that. He wants ankle. <laughs> he wants ankle pictures. <laughs> He's funny. <laughs> so I want to introduce you to someone right now from my English class. This is he just walked into that. He just walked up into that class. It took over. What do you think this is, friend? Come on. Yeah. Here she comes. Are you serious? Hey. Uh... I said, poop right in the f the... Hello? Oh, come on. <laughs> Let me buy you a cup of beers. How about Are you crazy? I might. Shut up. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. uh. I have never ever in my travels come across a man as large as you with as much muscles who has absolutely no penis. Oh, what is this movie? Do you have any idea how ridiculous it makes me look to have a man under my command start a f***ing bar brawl? It tastes like gravel. Not even edible. Or your ass is grass and I'm a lawnmower. Am I being fairly clear? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this this guy. Sergeant Major. Okay, Sergeant Major. Dick. What is a protective dike? Is that a large woman standing by the river going, Don't go near there. Uh, Betty. Don't, don't go near there. Get away from the river. Stay away from there. I know we can't use the word dyke. You can't even say lesbian. It's women in comfortable shoes. Thank you very much. Now, here's the weather. We're going to go right to Roosevelt. E. Roosevelt, Roosevelt, how's it going? <laughs> it's, I'm with somebody. Don't ever come here about me. Pissy weather front coming down from the north. Basically, it's a... <laughs> Look at how he's walking. So mad. You are not funny, but you are a maniac, and you better start changing your life. Golly. It's a privilege to take comedy notes from a man of your stature. Fine. <laughs> Just don't let it happen again. Oh my god. Bro, can't even read the sarcasm. Here's a little James Brown coming your James way. James Brown. Help me, please. Wow. I feel good. Like sugar and spice. Sugar and spice. <laughs> so nice. So nice. So nice. I got it, you. Wow. Interesting. These shots and the music kind of interspliced between all of the like soldiers and the tanks and the boats and the weapons and the fires and you know all the things indicative of war bringing together war and comedy interesting very interesting bayside queens what are queens tall thin men who like show tunes <laughs> no big men with mustaches named mary who wear mascara <laughs> <laughs> So her brother set set them up on a date and her whole family's coming as a chaperone. <laughs> wow. The East Germans today claim that the Berlin Wall was a paternity prank. Also the Pope decided today to release Vatican related Why do I feel like they built this movie around Robin Williams? So that he could do this. Period. Yeah, and it had no effect on me. Robin, please. How would you describe your testicles? That they're soft, but that they're shallow, but they have no purpose. What are you saying, sir? They lack physical strength. What's happening? How would you describe your sex life with your wife, Pat? It is unexciting sometimes. What do you consider the possible? Oh, no. Back in the United States, how would you do that? <laughs> they are going, they're flying off the wall. Every GI in this country is glued to his radio twice a day. And oh, 600 hours and six. They're both so mad. Bitter as f grapefruit and a lime. Nah, too juicy. They're dry. 
the rinds. They are fruit rinds. They are grapefruit rinds. Bitter, tough, inedible. There you go. I have over 15 years command experience in this army. Nobody cares. I don't want to miss my big chance. Yes, come to go. What is Twan? What about bananas? No. No, that doesn't say the right thing. You're right. How about... Holy shit! He was just in there. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, sh just got real. Like, real, real. That caught me so off guard. So off guard. Airman, you know the rules. If this is a legitimate news story, it must go through proper channels. Listen, Tweedledee. Censorship. This is not official news, Airman. As far as I'm concerned, it didn't happen. It did happen. You're not official. What the f? Why are we. Why? Well, absolutely not. He still has blood on his shirt. Good morning, Vietnam! Mm. I'm England. She's still married after six months. Way to go, Liz. Hey. Wow. Wow. Responded was believed to be unofficial at this present moment. Turn it off now! I just wanted to think that you should. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, it's not okay. It's not okay. That was a great bit of acting, though. A, gr a fantastic bit of acting. Wow. Why? Why, though? Yo, that would really turn my stomach just then. I run the station according to strict guidelines set by military intelligence. Military intelligence? There's a contradiction in terms. Sir, the man is a walking... I like him. Who do the Corona House show? Well, how can do it, sir? False. He drives a bone. Sir, you've made the correct choice. Rear. Oh, my God. I'm rolling my eyes so hard. I was trying to figure out something for him, but then the explosion happened, and I don't even think I can think anymore. See, you drink too much already. Well, tell him I drink so I can be this. He's responsible and protective and young. Yellow leather, red, red leather, yellow leather. Oh my god, I can't roll my eyes hard enough. Sir, you're not funny. Ask around. Ask me. Sir, you're not funny. <laughs> He's so prideful. Then I guess that would make you an Edie Gourmet. <laughs> oh. No. 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 <laughs> no, no, no. He had the horn and everything. Put it down. I love a good polka as much as the next man. Polka? Okay. I think some apologies are in order. Why? Actually, it was a fun song. But polka? <laughs> no offense if you're a fan of polka or do polka. I need to travel. I don't travel enough. I've been out in the country maybe like twice, and one of those times was just because I was on a cruise. I don't think that really counts. I haven't been to the other side of the world, and I want to. This is such a, a slow, quiet moment. Compared to the rest of it, that's been just kind of like. <laughs> okay, interesting. It looks like the like Charlie Chaplin just asking for Cronauer's reinstatement. The men all hate Hawk. They want Cronauer. I hate him too. Captain Hawk sucks the sweat off a dead man's body. <laughs> oh my God! Oh. I've been broadcasting the polkas because. I thought a certain segment of the men were- No, you're dry as a bone and boring as hell, bitter as f- Get over yourself. Intent read unofficial news. No, 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 no. You made a mistake. Unofficial news. It literally happened minutes before he walked in there. In my heart, I know I'm funny. Thank you, Luther. Why are you so adamant about this? Be funny in your heart then, man. In my heart, I know I am funny. Guess who the hell I got in here? Oh, don't do this. <laughs> do it. 
You like James Brown better? Yes, sir. And the Stones. Oh, you like Mick Jagger? Mick Jagger, right. Do you think he looks like a photo negative of Little Richard or am I crazy? <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, hair, like. Bringing joy into heavy situations. Laughter cares a lot. Well, you guys, you take care of yourselves. I won't forget you. Aww. You're lifting people's spirits, man. And you're doing a good job of it. That was a good moment. Way to go, garlic. You know what? Banana pudding is also a nice comfort food. Comfort sweet. That's what it is. Maybe I've just been wanting banana pudding for a really long time. But it's like, it's one of those things that when I eat it, it's just like, yeah, I miss this. Clouds of white, our blessed day, dark sacred night. Wow. This whole, like, just the tone, the tone of this movie next to all these shots of war, it's, like, it's really impactful. You got this, like, this light music up in the background and then then things like this is, wow. And you get, what a wonderful world, and there's this stuff going on. Wow. What a wonderful world. That's hard. That's really hard. He's got a very important journey. You know, lifting people's spirits and things like this are going on. You gotta have something. You gotta have something. No, sir, it does not. That road is Victor Charlie, sir. It is definitely not a friendly area. Negative, sir. What are you, what are you planning? Sir, I recommend we issue a 24-hour pass. Corrupt. You cannot be that bitter about somebody. No, we haven't passed too many checkpoints since Chantan. Chantan, why do you make everything? Oh, God. Please don't do anything to garlic. When you get out of the arm. I think I learned enough about radio stations. I mean... Oh, no. They're talking about what he wants to do when he gets out. He's gonna die. No! No, 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 no! Give it to me, Edward. This is Eddie Garlic. Come... Good morning, Vietnam! You're listening to Eddie. What is he? I don't know. What is like responsible and protective as a flavor or a texture? Support. Don't, uh, don't take the baby either. What is something, uh, my mind is saying bread. He's better than bread though. Like hunting with Ray Charles. Like hunting with Ray Charles. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. It okay. Juan. Hey, there you are, Colonel. Oh God. And they got the. Uh, uh, uh. All three of them. I like all three of them, and they're in danger right now. This is. I don't like this. Somewhere over there. Who is it though? Who is it? Who is it? Okay. 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 I'm still. It's too quiet. I don't trust this movie. You I'm informing you that you're out of here. Dickhead. Dick is a dickhead. I have the power. I'll take this right to the authority. I am the authority, you moron. Oh, I got your pansy ass in a sling now, Cronauer. A friend from my class who risked his ass to save my life? A friend. Amen. Your friend is a VC terrorist. <laughs> Juan is also known as Fan Duk To. He's currently wanted by the South Vietnamese police in connection with several bombings in the area. Including the one at Jimmy Waz. Surely you're familiar with that incident. He was the one that pulled him out of there. I'm sorry, son. Hmm. How do I feel? How do I feel? I don't know. He hates you, man. He's a butthole. I recommend you pack quietly. That's all I have for you, Airman. There are only a handful of characters across the collective history of film. You're in more dire need of a blowjob than any white man in history. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Anyways, there are very few characters that I hate with a passion like this. He's one of them. Dick, I'm transferring. Transferring me, sir? Mm -hmm. Get him. Where to, sir? Home. You're me. And this is just radio. He said you're mean. <laughs> he 
He's laughing. <laughs> More dire need of a blowjob than any white man in this. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, oh, hell. <sighs> Don't end badly. Don't end badly. What are you up to, though? Because I liked you. I feel so conflicted. I gave you my friendship and my trust. And now they tell me that my best friend is the goddamn enemy. Enemy? What is enemy? My mother is dead. And my other brother, who be 29 years old, he dead. Shot by Americans. Mm. My neighbor, dead. Why? Because we're not human to them. We're only little enemies. And I'm still about to save your bullshit life, but I'm not. We have learned a lot from you. Aww. And we wish you good luck with your success. Thank you, bro. Man, he's gonna say goodbye to the whole goddamn country now. <laughs> Yeah, why not? He built a lot of good relationship with them. Thanks. I'm gonna cut that out, garlic. We're the same rank. <laughs> what will I do? He built relationships with people both inside and outside. Good people person. There's no place like home and you can be there. <laughs> I hope. I hope we all could. Aww. Aww. That was a good movie. I don't even know how I feel. I think it was really well done and obviously Robin Williams played the perfect heart. And I, you know what, the whole thing with Tuan and them being friends and him protecting him and then, but you, you find out that he's part of the the terrorist group but you get that moment where you see all the emotion on on his face and him talking about all the people that he's lost like nobody i don't think how many people really are inherently bad you know what i mean like everybody has a reason for doing something no one sees themselves as the bad guy unless you do see yourself as the bad guy but no, it's just kind of like, it's not cut and dry, you know? There's a lot of gray area when it comes to things like war. And people are people in every country all around the world. People in America are no better than people in Vietnam or no better than people in England or no better than people in South Africa. Like, it, it, it's just, we are all human beings, you know what I mean? Trying to make the best of what we've got. And I think... That was a very heavy point in the movie. So I got my notes. I really enjoyed that. I am glad to have watched it. I think what we should do is get some Vietnamese food. Cronauer, he integrated himself into Vietnam and he got to know the people and their food and their lifestyle, made friends with them and taught them and yada yada and they taught him and and so I think it's just important to have a piece of that culture. So eat some Vietnamese food and I think he himself is will eat some banana pudding in his honor. Because to me banana pudding is a is a comfort sweet, brings life. <laughs> to the table you know what i mean stick around for the munchies and crunchies of that again this was a response to my question of what is your favorite robin williams movie so i will ask again what is your favorite robin williams movie because i only got the one response if you let me know what it is down in the comments then i'll get to it anyway make sure you subscribe Click the like button, comment, hype, hype it up. You know what I'm saying? Friend, we friends, we good. Like, can we be friends? Okay, thank you. Anyway, that's all she wrote. Bye. Yo, let's try to do this quickly. I went to this place called Lee's Bakery on Buford Highway. Quaint little place, relatively inexpensive. Good reviews. I got the food. I got several different things. Just things I wanted to try, basically. We'll start with this coffee. There wasn't really a reason for getting it. I just was in the mood for a coffee. The description looked pretty good. It has condensed milk in it. Vietnamese coffee. It smells divine. 
I was smelling up my car all the way home, so. Ooh. Yes. That's delightful. I don't even drink coffee like that, but that's really good. Dun, dun, dun. I'm, I'm flustered a little bit. My tripod wasn't working for my camera, so <laughs> you're just making me kind of mad. Also, Rumi just got home. He's gonna walk through the door at any minute now. Hmm. It does not smell much of anything. Ooh, this is my, I got a bond me. So let me put that to the side for a second. I got some shrimp and pork spring rolls. Give those a try first. I'm all over the place, look at me. I believe this is a peanut sauce that they came with. Ooh, smells peanutty. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's really good. Also, this has a very nice mouthfeel. It's real chewy and thick. Let's try it with the chili sauce. Hmm. It doesn't have much of a flavor, but it is. it has a kick. So it's spicy, spicy, spicy. <laughs> Not overwhelming, but it definitely kicks you back here. Let's set that to the side. Now I'll try the bond me. I believe I got, you know what? I don't even remember. I did any mini, mini, mo, and then I think just ended up getting the most popular one. It, yeah, it's um barbecue pork bond me. So it has all the veggies and the pork in it. Smells good. I'm gonna try to get a bite that has everything. I'm not gonna do this thing. No, you can't make me. Mmm. First of all, I think they make the bread themselves. It's good. It's really good sandwich bread. Second, that's amazing. It has like this, um, it's like sweet, crunchy, but also savory. Mmm. That, that's really good. I will keep eating it. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. I was not expecting all of that. Do you see it? Dang. He's coming in now. Hola, hola. Did you get my text? Okay. Don't mind me. It's gone. I don't know how to pronounce the word. It's a dry noodle dish, so it's not soup. I contemplated getting pho, but then I didn't. So I just didn't feel, I, whatever this was, this is what I wanted. There's a specific name for the type of noodle. I'll put it on the screen. I can't pronounce it, sorry. I don't know what this is. It looks like there's some peanuts over here. Probably a fish sauce, I think. And then there's just all kinds of veggies and meats in here. I think it's pork again. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's the same place that's in there. So good. And these little spring roll things. Mm-hmm, all so good. Okay, I'm just gonna kinda mixy-mixy a little bit here as best I can, cause dang, they filled this thing. All of the stuff that I got, 30 bucks, I think even less than, but it came out to be slightly more because of like convenience fees and taxes and stuff. But like otherwise, it was pretty, it was pretty cheap, you know? Oh, I didn't try the scrimps. A radioactive red shrimp. Mmm, that's good too. I'm just gonna go for it. Get a little this, get a little, get a little this. Mmm. <gasps> There's some kind of herb in this. Maybe like it's mint or something or, mm. It's so bright. Oh my goodness. That's really good. 
Yeah, I think it's mint. It totally smells like mint. Mmm. Mmm. Yo. Oh. Mmm. That makes all the difference. Wow, it's so bright. I like that a lot. This feels like something you could eat like somewhere hot, <laughs> like in the heat and the hot weather, you know, which totally fits. Wow, that is so good. Everything is amazing. It's really good. Yes, ma'am, yes, sir. I like it a lot. I made banana pudding too, so. I just realized I failed to take pictures of any of this before I started eating it. Now what am I gonna put on social media? So, <clears throat> coincidentally, Thanksgiving was yesterday. So my big thing of banana pudding that I made, I brought to my mama's house and everybody done ate that banana pudding up. I also <laughs> ate a lot of it. Listen, it's so good, but I'm gonna eat some more right now on camera. Man, and I don't even know how to explain it, but it tastes just like Robin Williams' character in that movie. I, listen, it is beyond me. Man, that is good. Uh, again, perfect for a hot name. Amazing. And I bet you it goes good with coffee. Now listen here. The contrast of cold and hot is interesting, but that bitterness chasing all that sweetness, yo. I am one happy camper today. After all that, yes ma'am, yes sir. So good, so good. What else is there even for me to say? Thanks for eating with me, bye.